Hello. So a few hours ago, they launched a Lars and Krista event. It's called the Dance of Ice and Lightning. <laughs> Pop culture reference there. Um, says the Dance of Ice and Lightning. Krista and Lars have created a perfect sparkling union of ice and lightning. Their mighty powers are waiting to be unleashed in full, setting them up on a rogue path of dangers and challenges that will let them develop their unique skills, become truly unstoppable. So... Um, they changed format again. Now it's on the top instead of on the side, so. Um, but. So we can claim all these, so boom. Wow, we completed a lot of quests already. Like, so a lot of these auto-completed, so I don't know what they all were. But, uh, they have them listed on the on the website or the Facebook page. Um, I know there's, like, sad food, but I have all my sad food. Lars and Chris, obviously, some of my most used heroes, so they were. Oh, wait, let's see. Hero skin. Any hero or large, like, I already have their artifacts max. So I'm confused on this one here. There was like a note. That I didn't read. I remember reading like a note on the Facebook page. Let's go look at that really quickly. What that says. All right. So it says we are aware of a quest completion issue. We're currently working on fix. If your large crystal skins or artifacts are maxed out, the task will be auto completed after the fix. So those are, so those are supposed to be auto completed because it's supposed to be specifically for large and Krista. Okay, so that's that's why I'm confused because it says any hero, but it says large crisp parentheses. So so I guess I remember seeing this pop up, didn't read it all. Um so yeah, so like that's uh, apparently a bug. So um the dance of ice and lightning events on bonus energy. Yeah, we got all that. Okay, so let's go try to head back to the game real quick. Alright, so Assume these are for like leveling like up leveling them up and evolving them and stuff. Um like said, because my Lars and Krista are, sorry, Krista, super maxed out, ascension rank five, boom. Everybody like said, pretty much fully maxed outside the mage branch. So my Lars is a lot more, um, less developed in this on purpose, try to keep his health a bit lower. Don't have his health skin. Said his ascension's only rank one. Like I said, this is this is a more intentional, but they have all their artifacts and stuff max, so a lot of those quests are auto completes. Um yeah, so I guess we can claim all these any coins we get, so. Whoa, we're getting a lot of coins. Wow. Whoa. 81,000? That seems like a lot. There's some bundles and stuff too. Can look at these bundles here. Secrets of Outland. Oh, you don't really have anything to do. I guess your skin stones if you need skins. Um, the heroic bundles, Lars and Krista doll. Interesting, Lars and Krista doll. They're kind of cute. I do like a lot of these other offer bundles that we've had in the past. Um... All right. Oh, and Secret Wealth's back, too. Let's see. All right. Where's the thing? Okay. Da, 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 da. Okay, so what other quest do we got? Any hero skin. So any artifact and then Crystal Lars artifact. That's it. There's two different requests. That's what it is. So skins. Buy VIP. Like I should probably bought wait to buy my gold ticket yesterday, but that's fine. Um Artifact. Let's see what else we got. Just some of these grays. Uh huh. So, hundred twenty. Uh, 
So it's at least 160. Boom. So that's like 200, I think we got. Come on. Yeah, just that we would have been like, maybe we did one unevenly. Guess what? Rufus wasn't quite there, huh? Rufus was on an odd number, huh? So let's see. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, 50 more times. Who hasn't had stuff? Try to get all of these here. I think it actually tells you the whole quest chain. Skin 300 times for a skin. I guess activating the book doesn't count as a level. It just takes it to level one. Which is too bad because it should be count as a level because it's zero to one. Yeah, it doesn't tell me how many is on this chain. You see that? I guess it's because I already started that chain. Okay, two more levels on something. One, two. There you go. So that's 300 on that one. Boom. Wow, we have like 150, 153,000 coins. Um, Hero skin 10 times though. Like that's a lot. Or a lot. It's like that goes all the way to like 300. So that's a lot of skin upgrades. Um, we do get some coins. Wow, this goes all the way to 22,000. That's a lot of points. You'd probably have to do a lot of spend emeralds and stuff, though. 45,000. Spending energy is only 10,000, though. VIP points. It's not even that much. Like, wow. It's actually not too bad. Okay, so let's see what's at the shop here. Lars and Krista doll. Yeah, it's like all those other dolls, except for you have Lars or Crystals. Um, you can also buy Lars Crystals directly, which might be better if you just specifically want the souls. Those will have like the other items, like Hand of Glory, um, Trader's Crown, Oracle Censure, Lamort's Card. Hand of Glory fifteen hundred is almost a bit kind of overpriced compared to some other events where it's only a thousand coins. Because this is still five thousand, this is gonna be a really good buy for most of you. Book of Tales for 3700 That's... Hmm, Book of Prophecy is a C8750. Oracle Center is 2100 Spear of Power is 1750 Enigma Chronicles 5000 It's like the Mort's card, the Enigma Chronicles, always really good. Um, yeah, I mean, Spear of Power, the Oracle Centers are, are, aren't too bad. Um... That it's mostly mage items, so but I'd say the Oracle Central way better buy than Book of Fate for the difference in price because it's only a thousand more. Um, but Lamort's card can't go wrong with Lamort's card or Enigma Chronicles. Sphere Power is okay, Oracle Central is okay. Trader Crown, eh. It says Sphere of Hand of Glory is okay, but I feel like that's a bit over costed. Skin Stones, I mean, if you don't have anything else, you can't go wrong with Skin Stones, though. So probably a better thing, like I said, the. The Morse card and stuff are probably going to be better for most people. Uh, yeah, no, this one's giving me a lot of coins. Like, it feels like they're giving out... This one's a lot more generous, the coins. So, definitely take advantage and stock up on the shop here. Try to get a bunch of these things. And it seems to be about 2,000 coins 
points per rank, at least after 4,000. Goes up to 22,000, wow. Yeah, most of these are pretty easy, and like these might auto-complete if you've already maxed out Lars and Krista, so. Um, so I'll probably get some more any hero skin. This one, this one has like one of the best, better quest chains. Spending emeralds. Yeah, I'm actually surprised at the skins, so this might actually be worth it just because of how many uh, you get there. I mean, if you do some of the lower skins, you might be able to make it work. I have quite a few skin stones. Um, but we really still, I still want to do Max Out Nebula skin to our new one. Yeah, but uh, yeah, not too much more to say on this one, though. Um, if you want to know more about Lars and Krista, please check out the video below. And as always, thank you for watching.